So today we want to show you the different setup of hydroponic systems we have at VLX Hydro Farm Research Center as you can see starting with the vertical towers vertical towers uh, is a type of hydroponic system you can uh, use uh, but mainly for commercial you may not need the vertical all these vertical towers to grow hydroponically uh, so there's this uh, system of a vertical tower and uh, you can apply it as i said in my previous videos we are trying to change these vertical towers uh, such that uh, they are in this format uh, you can see there's difference between uh, this net cap hole and uh, this net cap hole we find that this net cap hole is more efficient compared to uh, this one here. So the idea is that uh, water moves smoothly and it irrigates uh, the cup very well and uh, you end up having better growth. As I said, the challenge I have here uh, is the shade, the sun doesn't come through, especially the morning sun. As I will show you the impact of sun uh, when it comes to plant growth. So this is one setup. Setup number two is here. This is based on uh, simple, a simple uh, system. Um, a, you get water bottles and uh, you format them, make them like this. Uh, but again. Uh, here you need to make sure that uh, you use a wall, place them somewhere where they can get enough sun. So that is setup number two. Going to setup number three. Yeah? Setup number three. Setup number three. Yeah? We have these uh, growth of, of hydroponics based on simple buckets uh, this you can buy these simple buckets you can see here the growth of basil is good very good it is even getting a little old but uh, uh, as a research center we do quite a lot of research so sometimes we don't grow for purpose of selling but discovery journey so this is based on uh, what we call buckets, uh, simple, a simple uh, bucket, and you make your net cap holes, and you'll be able to grow hydroponically. This is setup three. Setup four is where you can uh, use this wooden kind of system and the uh, pipes. Again, this one is cracky; doesn't require any sort of uh, sort of uh, a pump this is setup number four so this is where we are let's share other setups again this is setup number four similar to what i showed you the setup number four same this is a smaller version there's a good setup here which is only based uh on pipes there's no reservoir uh, so this is a very good setup so you can see very growth very good growth rather of uh, a bezel coming through this is a, also a setup you can start make just buying the pipes join buy a simple pump and then you'll be having very good growth this one has a pump as you can see the pump pumps water it goes up and it moves through the system so this is setup number five we have setup number six here we haven't grown anything in it so setup number six is also good good for your uh, back yard good for your your compound you can put it in a compound uh, so this is set number setup number six so we go to setup number seven I have two systems here. Uh, this is setup number seven. Very simple. But again, I'm going to 
convert this into a saturating uh, system uh, as it has not worked as I expected. Uh, whereby I go, I'm going to put a pump on it. Again, this is setup number a uh, number six, same as the previous. Uh, there's a little one here you can put on the wall. The amazing one, which is cheap, easy, doesn't require a lot of effort, is setup number number seven, I think eight. Uh, the numbering doesn't matter, but you get the concept. So this is based on water gutters. Water gutters are cheap. You can have this set up at less than a hundred dollars because water gutter. I think this long water gutter costs about cost about maybe ten dollars. Maybe you need four of them. You need uh, these fasteners. These uh, these uh, uh, these uh, these ones to make the water gutter get fastened on the wall uh, then you need the end caps of water gutter uh, the, so very simple and then you need this uh, um, it's called foam board but if you don't have foam board you can use styrofoam this is styrofoam styrofoam these are uh, materials that come uh, in our uh, packages when you buy it, a TV or a fridge you don't throw them away you can use that uh, you can watch my previous videos as I show you how I make the holes there are many videos I've posted uh, so here you can see uh, you can uh, be able to grow uh, plants hydroponically for home you need just set up this is enough for you it will resupply you leafy greens uh, throughout uh, the year and uh, it's it's a good systems very easy to set up so uh this is eight and uh, i think that's pretty all it i had to share there's maybe nine here based on styrofoam I harvest this, I harvest the leaves and I leave the stem to continue growing to give you more leaves rather than cutting the entire stem. And then here, there's some little setups here. So we, we try to continue, we try to continue to make more research in the area of hydroponics. Then there is a vertical tower here. Uh, there are vertical towers, single towers. This one plants about 40. Uh, so uh, the, the also vertical towers that side. So th these are the different setups. Almost 10, 10, 10, 10 different setups you can utilize. You can ride on. You can s come up with. I've showed you the easiest one to make. This is a bit complicated uh, as you require uh, te techniques to uh, some some skills knowledge to uh, uh, to to make these net cap holes uh, but the easier one um, is the one I showed you uh, in the uh, on the wall so thank you so much for listening to me and I look forward to sharing more content in the journey of hydroponics this is the future of farming. The future of farming is not going to change. Uh, today things are going to uh, move towards hydroponics because hydroponics saves, first of all, land. It is a revolutionary way of farming, a groundbreaking technique of farming. Remember, the population is growing, but land is not growing. And it, is, it doesn't require weeding. So that's what I had to share today. And thank you very much for uh, listening to me, watching my videos. Please follow for more, subscribe to my channel. And I look forward to sharing more videos. In fact, my previous videos, how I made all of this, uh such that you can also choose whatever you want to to make
to grow plants hydroponics hydroponically thank you very much bye for now